everybody, and welcome to the Papa and Alina Show. And we have the Madrigal, Madrigal house. And I think that this part is cool. It turns from the rainbow to the cloud. And then this little wooden thing opens and shuts by knobs. And then on the inside, the bed flips just like that so more to the inside if you this is Antonio from the movie this and this is Isabella's room and this is what's her name Maribel's room this is her um instrument she plays and then I'm gonna put her back in bed and then this is the grandma's room. She's with her clock. And then also another thing is the candle. Who fell? My bell. So yeah. Turning it back with round. One sec. They have a I made a little candle for her. A oh, this little bow, a sewing machine, and the house, the Madrigal's house is number four three two zero two. <laughs> Hi! This is the talented grandma. She's like, Hi. Oh yeah, this is the new part. It's a capybara. As you can now see. And the cool thing is that the capybaras are actually, I'm pretty sure we have one in here, are actually, not know what one is right now, but the size of a hamster, of a Lego hamster. Oh, I found one. So the same old, except more detail that the face and the different color. Hi, is that cool, Pa? Oops. Alexa, timer off. Capybara, turning him down. And then the little box from that is not signed yet. Nothing is signed. Or <coughs> capybara treats. And that I think <laughs> that is an Easter egg. It is really bad for everyone. And there's spot. Just clean up a bit here. Here we have the lamp swings up and down. And then down here. Here, I'm have to lift it up. Down here, there's a little umbrella. Pink umbrella. Dining room. You can take the chairs out to like do stuff with, to like make it um so that you can I don't know so you can put the people in. That's what I was trying to say. I got a bit stuck. Ow. Mm. This player is cool, and the kitchen is talented. bit detailed like the pot and the stickers I think in the back is de talent detailed oh my gosh something is the word and in the front of the house I like the butterflies and the flowers and all that cool stuff and then on the seat in here I like the flat I mean the butterfly in there and I like the door this is basically the parts I like about the house now 
And in the little drawer, you might be wondering, hey, what's in the little drawer? Well, I need my tweezers for this, because I do not have good fingernails to do this with. My fingernails are very not sharp. So there is all the stuff. It's little forks. I'm gonna chop it. I'm gonna put those all back quickly. Because I like them being organized. Put it back in. Mm. I think that's about it for now. Except for the pan is cute. The teapot is cute. Just playing out some little kitchen and wall details quickly. There's like a bottle of um licorice or um grown up drink, a flower in a vase. Then up here in Abuela's room. Dad thought it was Bruno's room. My dad thought it was Bruno's room because of this. And I put in the little flower, and there is a gemstone right here. Another look at the of peoples. There's Abuela. Mirabel. Antonio. And Capybara. Capybara. I need to get one more detail. Oh, there. The detailed door. It says Maribel on it, and then that one. The side. Yeah. Maribel's right there in Kurzu. M M. Mirabel. Right, Mirabel. So, oh yeah, on the walls, I like the like paintings right here, and then on the other side. This one is Mirabelle's family, and this, where is it, one is Antonio's family, his parents, Papa, and um, the other guy, I don't know his name. Tree. You know where the family tree is, right guys? I'm not gonna spoil in case you haven't watched the movie. So I'm not gonna do a spoiler alert. But if you do know what the family tree is and who the house is behind it, um comment that down below. Make sure to like, subscribe, and if you have a YouTube channel, share the name of it down below. Bye!